evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid. And the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town. And uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too. And uh, all of it adds up to make it terrific a trackling atmosphere the match i think will be quite a spectacle this one of the great amphitheaters of the game you are welcome to it and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures and this is the perfect game for all parties not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it well on the face of it peter we would appear to have a high caliber meeting with very little at stake but then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in. And this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest. Things have got on the way here pretty promptly. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Harry Kane. He's a deadly finisher. Peter, obviously, but he can contribute much more than that for his team. He's got the physical presence to hold the ball up and the awareness to bring pretty much everyone else into play. His best attributes, however, might be his, his enthusiasm, his energy and his desire to win because those things become infectious to others. Yes, he's certainly the one who carries the hopes of his team. Perisic, Son Heung-min. Son Heung-min has a goal! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Tottenham are looking quite mean on the counter and combating that requires even more meanness. Carl Storp. Out to the left it goes. Roma going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Matic. Forward it goes. Hoists it forward. Karsdorp is charging up on the overlap. Dybala! Deba Goal! Roma! And Roma take the lead! Dybala at his razor-sharp best there. Our oh, players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great poaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Roma break the deadlock and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on Matic positions himself well and cuts it out Spinazzola hardly anything between the sides and it's 1-0 Smalling, Karstorp, Smalling, Karstorp, back to the keeper and go again, Matic, Spinazzola, and it's Al Sharawi, Dybala, Dybala, and Dybala! A potential goal of the season contender, if only. Well, at least the crowd are appreciative of his efforts.
just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Well played, he saw that coming. Winks. And here's Son Hyung Min over to the left. There will be a throw in. Son Hyung Min, and he's cut it out. Fine save! Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Ball, it's found its target. <laughs> Brings it forward. Al Sharawi! Save again, same outcome. They're just. There is the half time whistle. So there you have it. A close fought half of football. But it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to this. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well, there's good movement off the ball, the passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Roma leading 1-0 at the break. And the game has already resumed here. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. al Sharawi. Spinazzola, Dybala, Zaniolo, Dyer, Kane, now it's Son Hyung Min, it's got through to him, oh well defended, that had to be done, Smalling goes looking, Dybala, whose goal scoring skills have already been evident, And it's Al Sharawi. Al Sharawi spreads it towards the left. Lucas Moura. Now it's Kane. Kane not easily shrugged off the ball and back to base. Matic. So, Jim, what are you thinking? They're ahead, but. They're not playing as if they are. There seems to be uh, more of an emphasis on protecting their lead than, than adding to it. It's all gone a little timid. Dybala. Spinazzola. Dybala. It's come through. Hits one! Breaks on here, and it's played forward. Now it's Lucas Moura. Going to, it's Lucas Moura! That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. El Sharawi tries to stroke it through. Big chance, corner. Tottenham are making a change now. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. And they've been caught out here. Goes for goal! It's obvious that they prefer a greater cushion to sit on, but will they?
Ricky Lund battles to win it back. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. It is just a question of running down the clock now. And it's Al Sharawi. Smalling. And time is up. Roma win it by the only goal. Result.